Alderman Jason Irvin, like many grooms to be, had a bachelor party shortly before his wedding in November of 2012. It was, by all accounts, like all bachelor parties, I guess, a private party. And what happened in the last few days, well over a year after the bachelor party occurred, was that somebody posted a two minute, 23 second video clip from the bachelor party on Facebook, alleging that it had happened in the alderman's office. In fact, it didn't happen, according to Irvin at least, precisely in his office. It happened at the same building where his office is located, on the west side, in his ward, of course. He has a ward office there at 2602 West 16th Street. In that building, uh, his office is on the first floor, as is the office of the 28th Ward Democratic Organization that he had. The party, according to the invitation which we obtained, was on the third floor in a different part of the building, but it was the same landlord. And we have not been able to determine who was renting that space, if anyone, at that time. The alderman says was not part of his office suite and not part of the building that he was leasing. So the other possibilities are that there was another tenant there at that time who let him use it or that the landlord let them use it. Initially, the alderman said, this is a private party. It's nothing to do with my official capacity. It happened at a private place. He would not say to our Franz Spielman at City Hall where exactly this party took place. We later told him that we had a copy of the invitation and knew that it happened in the same building as his ward office. And at that point, he issued a statement saying that while it was a private party, it happened under the same roof as his office, just in a different part of the building and he apologized for any embarrassment that it might have caused to the people of the ward. No this ain't number silhouette. And regrets that it may be overshadowing all the great things that he's done, which of course, in his opinion, merit his reelection in 2015. Uh, I will add that on Facebook, when they first posted this video, the caption was, Women for Irvin in 2015, and that's when he'll be up for his second term, assuming that he runs again. Don't do that because they will stop their show, baby. All right.